Shall we make a record of our adventure, Crispell? I want to record our pr Master Wilhelm, did you manage to find a way to open the book? Indeed. We found the ring and managed to open it. Wonderful. But could I trouble you with something else? Of course. Could you give me that book, please? Huh? That book is the last memory of my dear friend Gladys. I would like to keep it in honor of her. I suppose it's for the best. You can have it. Oh, dear. Thank you. I want you to have this. Perhaps you'll find greater use for it. I guess that's all we're going to learn from the book. Yes. Let's resume following our other priorities. You are as effective as usual, Master Wilhelm. It would be great if we could travel by water. Oh, hello, my darlings. How are you enjoying the mountain air? I don't suppose you bought any new clothes while you were in Nevatalira, did you? Oh, no. We, um, ran into some problems, actually. Would you mind doing us another favor? Anything for you, my little peach. We have to travel down the river to reach the Rainbow Lake. Hmm. I don't think I could make it past the mountains. At least not anytime soon. But it's just a river, you say? Maybe you can use my shoe. It's big enough to carry you and exquisitely made, so it won't weigh you down. Make sure to bring it back, though. I do hate to lose anything stylish. Thanks, Paulina. Oh, and one other thing. Do you happen to recognize Buki here? She seems to have lost her memory. Hmm, let me look at her. Oh, hello there, there, there. G -g 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 Good morning, sweetie. Aren't you a lovely one? I've never seen one of our kind dressed so nicely. Unfortunately, as you can s s s see, I'm not in any condition to be p p putting out 
refreshments. She seems familiar, but... I'm sorry, my darling. I honestly can't remember much. That's okay. Thanks anyway, Miss Paulina. Everyone, let's go try out this shoe! Seems like you can use the shoe here. Do you want to use it? Sure. Do you want to land here, Crispo? Yes, this is the right place. Seems like you can use the Sure. Do you want to land here? Yes, this is the right place. Seems like you can... Sure. Do you want to land here? Yes, this is the right place. Rainbow Lake? Indeed it is. Technically, it's a collection of small pools formed by mineral springs, but they do overflow into one large lake later in the year. We'll need to visit each pool to collect all the minerals we need. Be careful, though. These pools have some magical properties. Sometimes, when a talented time mage comes here, they react in surprising ways. I remember when I first came here and... Never mind. Let's just go. Crisbell, what do you want? I want to record our pro-
Here it is. The first pool. Crisbell, why don't you collect a sample for Rojo? But be careful. The pool may react to you. Okay. It's the orphanage in Nareem. Empty and abandoned after some disaster. The pool seemed to be reflecting your sight. For once, we can all see what you see. I remember seeing this before. This was my first real vision. I was so scared and confused. Hey, this future's not gonna happen. I promise. We're likely to see more visions as you visit the other pools. Have you finished collecting the sample? Oh, yes. I've bottled up some of the mineral water. On to the next one, then. That statue has been sitting there for as long as I can remember. I think it may be another one of the witnesses, but I've never seen it move. He looks so f f f f f familiar Oh, I wish, wish I could remember. Well, perhaps it will start moving soon. Stranger things have happened on this journey of ours. I doubt it, but I suppose anything is possible.
We've arrived at another pool. Be careful, Chris Bell. Here I go. I see two strange people talking to each other. Oh, look, my, 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 my children. Your children? You mean those people in the white coats? Who are they? Hmm. Deary me. Those are researchers, I think. I'm sorry, sweet, sweet, sweetie. My mind isn't what it used to be. I'm so confused. I think we all are. But she doesn't seem to remember anymore. Well, we have collected the mineral water. Let us move on to the next pool.
Chris Bell, what do you want? I want to record our progress. Here it is. The third pool. What is this? It looks like two monsters fighting. How bizarre. Why would you be seeing this? I don't know. What a strange vision. I guess we shouldn't worry about it for now. I finished collecting the mineral water. Then let us move on to the next pool. Hello there! These lakes look beautiful. I love the colors. The healing properties of the waters of this place are incredible. I know they're used for a multitude of things, including things that I have in stock. Besides, they're great for dogs. Hannah's fur looks dazzling.
is that? A hero of legend. Oh, I've heard of this one. He's one of the warriors who died fending off the Empress. I think he was the one who was supposed to have struck the final blow. But he lost his life in the exchange. Old legends. Nothing more. Have you collected the mineral water yet, Crispell? Yes, Maestro. I have it. Let's go then. There's still one more pond to visit. And it is by far the most potent. flower I see growing above the pond yes we call it the Millennium flower it's been here for ages absorbing minerals from the pool as a result it's almost overflowing with magical power the flower grows very slowly but it's actually older than me <laughs> like that saying much no one asked for your opinion lunch for brains that will be enough both of you we are here to collect the mineral water. On to the last pool. Here we are. I've got the mineral water. going to see a vision this time? I wonder... Oh, um, I'm starting to feel faint. Crisbell, are you alright? I think another vision is coming. And this time, it's much, much stronger than the others. <laughs> The destruction of the entire world. Explosions everywhere. Hundreds of thousands dead. And at the center of it all? The Time Empress! Did someone just call my name? You! It can't be! What are you doing here? It seems my timing is impeccable as always. But relax. I'm not here for you lot. I'm here for the flower. I don't know what you're planning to do with that flower, but... We've seen your evil plan, and we're going to stop you right here! Stop me? But I haven't even gotten started yet, my dear girl. Well, I suppose this will give me a good opportunity to see how you're coming along. Do try and at least entertain me for a bit. We're about to kick your butt!
Playtime is over, children. Oh, you're done already? But I was just getting warmed up. This is not over. But of course it's not. This was so fun. Let's do it again, shall we? One of you has some decent time power within. But you can't stop it, darlings. Oh no! We need a miracle to save us! I will transport you to safety. Leaving so soon? Oh well. I suppose I should just carry on and retrieve the flower then. Barely escaped alive. That statue saved us. I am not a statue. However, you are otherwise correct. I used my maximum acceleration to remove you from danger. And thank goodness you did! I was afraid we were done for. Not to be ungrateful, but who are you? What are you? I am JKR, unit number 721, one of the witnesses. JKR721? That's quite a mouthful. How about I just call you K for short? K? Where'd you get that from? What? I think it's pretty normal to use someone's middle name as a nickname. Well, I guess I can't argue with that. You may address me however you prefer. Well, thank you very much for saving us, Mr. K. We're all pretty beat up. We need somewhere safe to rest. Let's head to Paulina and regroup. Crisbell, what do you want to do? I want to record our progress. Seems like you can use the shoe here. Do you want to use it? Sure. Do you want to land here, Chris? Yes, this is the right place. Oh my darlings, just look at your clothes. Something dreadful must have happened. You don't know the half of it, Miss Paulina. Do you mind if we rest here for a while? Of course, of course. Make yourself at home. We should be safe here for a while. Thank you again, Mr. K. I don't know what we would have done if you hadn't saved us. The action was consistent with my nature. How do you mean? I am not entirely sure. The relevant entries appear to be missing from my memory banks. You're one of those witnesses, right? Do you know Paulina and Buki? Buki? Oh, oh, right. Th that's that's me. me, me. <laughs> it's nice to meet you, dearie. <laughs> For the first time? Maybe? I do detect something familiar about them. But I cannot recall our specific relationship. Me neither. Although there's at least one thing we know for sure. I was definitely not your stylist. Although I wouldn't mind finding out who was. While I appreciate all the catching up, I think we should allow Chris Bell and her friends to sleep. Thanks, Matthias. <sighs> we'll resume.
them in the morning. If that is where you're headed, then I shall accompany you. Great! I knew we could count on you, Kay. What exactly makes you want to follow us around? I have unfortunately lost the data that was supposed to be stored in my memory banks. I will need to begin accumulating replacement knowledge about the world as I search for the cause. I am certain I was created with a purpose. I wish to discover what it was. So, you want to find out more about who you are and why you lost your memories? I suppose that makes sense. Just try not to get in our way. There is no need to worry. I have significant combat capabilities. Have a safe trip, my darlings. Feel free to come back anytime. Isn't Rojo waiting for us in the cathedral? We shouldn't keep him waiting. Monsters! What are they doing here? They must have found their way here from deeper in the mines. This will serve as a good opportunity for me to demonstrate my capabilities. My style of combat is different than that of a typical human. My body is constantly being supplied with crystal energy, so I do not use mana. I have great speed and stamina, allowing me to strike many times whenever I attack an enemy. However, whenever I attack or use a skill, my heat level rises. As it rises, I become stronger, but there is also a risk of overheating my systems. Let us proceed to a demonstration. Press the button each time I begin to glow to trigger additional attacks. Whenever I attack or use a skill, my heat level rises. As it rises, I become stronger, but I run the risk of overheating myself. I also possess the ability to change the positions of enemies. By using my juggle skill, I can move this enemy to the other side of the battle.
Now, let me demonstrate my impact strikes. For this attack, press the button repeatedly. Try to keep the indicator in the yellow area for maximum damage. Now, let us finish disposing of these errant monsters. Crisbell. We should rest for Seems like Crisbell, what do you want to do? I want to record our progress. Hello, Mr. Rojo. We brought the mineral water. Well, I see you're as good as your word. It's nice to see that someone around here is. How long do you think the repairs will take? Hmm. Uh, I don't imagine it should be too long. Just hold on tight. And there we have it. <laughs> Good as new. This is impressive handiwork. It worked. The mural is fixed. Crispell. Why don't you try approaching the altar now? I told you, there's nothing that I can't repair. I hate that Risa. She barely even goes to Mass, but was still always Mom's favorite. You are as effective as usual, Master Wilhelm. It's working! leaves just two more cathedrals to visit. One in Cinder, and one in Crystallis. Although, I think we still have a little bit of unfinished business here. Uncle Wilhelm, here you are. Oh, uh, hi, Risa. What are you doing here? She just said she was looking for me. What is it, Risa? Is everything okay? Not exactly. The memorial service for Mom is about to start. But I'm worried that our dear Auntie Rollis is going to try something. Lucio and I haven't found any concrete evidence to use against her yet. But after what we all saw in the museum, I just know she had something to do with Mom's death. I see. Crispell, I knew Gladys for a long time. She was more than just a close friend. She was like a sister to me. I really like to attend this memorial service and maybe we can help straighten out whatever's going on with them say no more maestro we understand and risa of course will help great the memorial service is being held at the orowitz mansion on the north side of town i'll see you all there this sensation i felt it in the other cathedrals before You are as effective as usual, Master Wilhelm. I hate that Risa. She barely even goes to Mass, but was still always Mom's favorite. I told you, there's nothing that I can't repair. I'll see you all there. Crispell, 
We have important matters in the cathedral. Chris Bell, what do you want? I want to record our pr some of these things. Normally when I pass by a city, all the people and things have disappeared into the flow of time. Maybe this is a strange question, Mr. K, but does that mean you don't have any friends? I have had many friends, but it is not the same with me as it is with you. Once I really know a person, that is enough for me. Then I move on. That sounds really sad. I don't feel that way. After all, humans have such short lives that there are always new people to know. Another Sindarian. In Tulira? What? Sorry. I was just... Slow down. Take a breath. Or pass out, I suppose. I'm so sorry. I was just... Looking at Joseph. What? No! Is it that obvious? Only for those with eyes. You've clearly been staring at him. Ignore him. So, you're in love with Joseph, is it? Shh! He might hear us. Doubtful. He appears to be as focused on himself as you are on him. No! That's not how Joseph is! At least, he didn't used to be. What do you mean? We were very close when we were little. He was actually the only one who treated me nicely when I got here. I just don't know what's happened. Do you think you could speak with him? Well, he was my student. I suppose I can talk to him. But that's not the Joseph I remember. I know he's changed, but deep down, he's got to be the same person. It's just that ever since his mother died, he... It's all that Oroitz's woman's fault. She even stole my mirror. Gladys? No! Miss Gladys was so supportive of him. Of us! I mean, Rollis. I see. Fear not! What nobler cause could there be than true love? We'll help you. It's our sacred duty. Sacred duty? Humoring a lovesick girl whose notable skills include staring at people for an uncomfortably long time and misplacing mirrors? I... Stop. Things never get better when you speak. I'll go talk to Joseph. It's been a long time, Joseph. Master Wilhelm, you're back? Are you tutoring anyone else? Risa could certainly use some help. She's been worthless since Mother died. Huh. Has she also forgotten her manners? Or is that just you? Whatever. What do you want? From you? It appears you have nothing of any worth to give. Unfortunate. Then go away, fool. Who asked you to come back anyway? I can't. Stop, boy. Words won't work. However, there might be something we can find to help change his attitude. But where do we start? Saul said Joseph hasn't always been this way. Especially not with her. Perhaps we should see for ourselves. Matthias? An excellent idea. To the past I go. Joseph, stop that! Why are you treating Saul that way? That's not like you. But Mother, she's a Cinderian. The twins were mocking me for being friends with her. 
It doesn't matter where she's from. You know that. And since when do you pay attention to what they think anyway? Ignore all of that. Do you like this girl? I do. A lot. Then stop being such a ridiculous brat and go to her. Here, give her this. A mirror? A very special mirror. If you focus, it can show you a vision of the future. It's not working. Wait. I see. We look happy together. Very happy. You see? Now, if you're quite done being so profoundly foolish, I suggest you go find that girl. I... I really like her. I... I really like her. He used to be a nice kid. So it seems. Still, something is missing. And where's that mirror? I want to have a look at it. That must be the mirror Soul said Rallis took. I think it's the mirror we found. Interesting. From what we've heard, the mirror was imbued with powerful magic. <sighs> In its current state, though, it's worthless. It needs to be repaired. We could ask Rohal. No good. He's got his hands full repairing the mural. Then what about his son? Rohizo, I think it was? Chris Bell's right. Maybe we should try talking to him. Then let us speak with Rohizo. Oh, you're the outsiders that Dad gave the tools. What can I do for you? Hello, Rohizo. We were wondering if you could help us fix this mirror. I'm not as skilled as Dad, but I'm pretty good with glass. Let me take a look. Interesting. It's not like anything I've ever seen, but it's familiar. I think I've read about this in a book before. Is this a magic mirror? Correct. You're well-versed in Talirin artifacts. Do you think you can repair it? I have most everything here, but I remember thinking you would need something peculiar to create a mirror like this. So, to fix it, you'd need that too. What was it? I suspect you're thinking of rainbow water. Rainbow water? Yes, exactly. I had forgotten. Wonderful. What you have forgotten is only the single most important component. This does not bode well. However, let me give you some insight. Oh no. Here's where he... Agua Prisma, or rainbow water is a crucial component in the creation and repair of certain objects imbued with time magic. Because the rainbow water itself is infused with the magic of the mineral pools, it is uniquely suited to contain the powerful time energies required. Oh, interesting. So, can you get some of that stuff? Indeed. We already gave your father the samples he required. Getting more will be no trouble. Great! I'll get everything ready, and we can start when you bring back the sample.